I can see the McDonald's. Can I get um, one of all of your Christmas menu stuff that you're doing? <laughs> That's not a combo I like. Why have I never gone for this before? Three, two, one. How is it going and welcome to the channel. Now, as we are approaching Christmas, lots of Christmassy things are appearing in fast food restaurants. That's right, they're bringing out their Christmas special menus. And I thought, you know what? We need to try these special Christmas menus. So we're starting with McDonald's. We're gonna try their Christmas menu. We're gonna rate it. We're gonna see what's our favorite, what's our worst. So let's head to McDonald's and order the Christmas menu. Guys, let me know in the comment section below, what is your favorite Christmas food from a fast food place? Let's go. Oh my word, it's a cold one. It's like quite deceptive, isn't it? You go outside, you think, ah, not gonna take a coat or anything, but like, I don't know if you can see that. Actually, I probably shouldn't be doing that around. It's so cold and I'm in a, literally a jumper, that's all. Hopefully this McDonald's is gonna warm me up. I'm blind! Oh, the sun. The sun is just gleaming in. It was a foggy, oh, I'm blind! I cannot see. But the thing is, this thing is not gonna... Oh, actually, oh, there we go, that's perfect. <laughs> the sun is just out, like this morning it was, oh, it was nippy. I've got the seat warmer on, I've got the heating on, because it is cold in this car. But it's all good, because we're gonna go get some McDonald's Christmas food. You know, that's what it's all about. That's all that we can do. Let's go for drive throughs I honestly, I haven't been through a drive through in so long. I say that, and I like, probably went through one last week or something, but... <laughs> I literally, I can't remember the last time I went through one. Oh, it's gonna be nice at McDonald's though. It's gonna be nice. I don't even know actually what they have on their Christmas menu. I know that they've got, they've got just carrots, like reindeer treats, which is just carrots. I know that they've got a new, I think they've got a new Big Mac. They've got like a big, big Big Mac. And then hopefully they've got some like, Christmassy kind of shakes or something. But I don't know, we're just, we're just gonna get everything. You know, why not? Let's just get it all. Guys, I think we have an issue. My car's just come up and it's saying that my tire pressure on my back wheel is really low. It's just, it's just gonna be the worst if I've gone over a nail or something, isn't it? As I was driving, I feel like there was something wrong and now it's confirmed it. Oh no, maybe we're not even gonna make it to the McDonald's. I can see it in my sights. I can see the McDonald's. It's a queue big? Oh, it's not very big. That is surprising. I thought they'd like still be queues from when it was closed down. All right, okay. We are here at McDonald's. Let's get some food. I'm just gonna say, can I just have everything Christmassy? I want a full Christmas McDonald's menu here. Oh, what have they got? They've got the jerk chicken sandwich. Oh, that looks very nice indeed. Hello. Hello. Hi there. Um, can I get um one of all of your Christmas menu stuff that you're doing? You've got the jack chicken, double big mac, double quarter pounder, and cheese fries. Yes, and then um any desserts as well. So like the celebrations or the the carrots, any drinks as well that you have. That's like all the Christmas stuff. What drinks do you have? We have salted caramel. Salted caramel. Yep. Let's do that. If that's a Christmas drink, then yeah. Any of the yeah, any is. any of the Christmas drinks, I'll just take all of them. Is there anything else that's on the Christmas menu that's new? Um, if you just give me one moment, that's alright. Thank you. Bet they don't have many people saying, can I have one of everything off the Christmas menu? Yeah, that's all. That's all. Uh, oh, okay, perfect. All right, that's great then. Would you like any pie? Um, no thanks, no. Alright, thank you, London. Thanks, bye. We've got, we've got them all. We've got everything, apparently. Hi, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Very good, thanks. So that's ever that's everything off the Christmas menu, is it? Yeah. yeah okay. Oh, okay. Amazing. Thank you very much. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. The reindeer treats. Perfect. Is that everything? Yeah. Thank you so much. Have a good Christmas. Right. We are off. We have got everything off the Christmas menu. Let's go. I'm excited for this. We've got a feast on our hands. I'm gonna be blind again. Don't blind me, please. Ah, blind! Can't see a thing. God damn it! All right, here we are. We're back. We've got we've got so many different things. We've got cheese melt dippers. We've got quarter pounders. We've got carrots. But we just basically just need to go straight into this. And I think actually, I think the first thing we'll go for is these twelve cheese melt dippers. The share box. They kind of look like chicken nuggets, but they also kind. 
Well, we've lost one now. They kind of look like chicken nuggets, but they're not because they're like, well, cheese things, right? But what we have here is some tangy tomato dip, which I think came with it or they just gave it to us. Oh, it does smell a bit tangy. That is a tangy dip right there. All right, let's try it. The cheese dipper. Mmm. Oh, wow. That's actually quite good. That's actually really good. I'm going to try one on its own to see what it's like. I want to actually see. Is it? Oh, look, there's like stretchy cheese inside. Oh, that is a good old cheese, cheese bite right there. That's nice cheese as well. I would rate that on a cheese level. Se se we're going for 7 out of 10. I think that's a, that's a strong 7 out of 10 right there. Next up is the reindeer treats, a.k.a. baby carrots. So we're getting in our health right here. You know? Oh, as I open them, I just got this what intense waft of carrot. But that is what you're getting. That right there. Can we focus on the carrot? That's what you're getting right there. The baby carrot. It's just not going to go back to me now, is it? Ah! I mean, I'm not going to lie. I'd never go to McDonald's and pick some carrots. But it's like a bit, um, it's a bit watery. Just because I don't like raw carrots, I'm going to give that a two to three just because i don't really eat carrots raw i think what we actually need to do we need to try a carrot with the tangy the tangy sauce <laughs> that's not a combo i like i think it's just mainly the carrot i just don't like the raw carrot this one i'm excited for because i've seen a lot of adverts about this but this is the jerk chicken sandwich jerk chicken sandwich let's have a little look Oh, that is not too shabby. Nicely presented right there. That is, you know, that is not too bad. I always find with fast food places, they add a little bit too much lettuce in. It's like a lot of lettuce, but looking at things. Oh, hold on. We don't want that chicken to fall out. Looking at things like this. Look at that. An award winning jerk chicken sandwich. But how does it taste? That's the real question. Mmm. Oh, wow. That's really good. It's almost like chicken tenders with a bit of onion, salad, bacon, and cheese. I think these literally are, are these literally chicken tenders that they've just put in? I'll tell you what though, it's really good. It's really nice that is. Wow, I'm gonna have another little bite. Got a bit of the jerk sauce that time. That's nice, I'm gonna give that, like, I'm gonna give it an 8.5, 8.5 out of 10. That was really good. A little bit of spice, the spice is tangling, the spice is coming in now. But that was lovely. To switch things up, we're gonna go for a little dessert. Now, I feel like we have talked about this and we have eaten this on the channel before, and that is one of James's worst things he's ever had in his life. Millionaire's donut. The blooming donut. The millionaire's donut right there. I actually thought it was quite good when we tried it, but we're gonna we're gonna go for it again and we'll rate it. Ready? I've got chocolate all over my lips. You know what? That's a good donut. I don't actually know what the mid middle bit is. That's like a seven and a half, I'd say. Seven out of ten. You, you're competing with like Krispy Kreme, Crosstown Donuts, but that's not bad. I'm gonna give that a seven. Guys, if you could get a donut from any place, where would it be? Would you go to Crosstown Donuts? Would you go to Krispy Kreme? Would you go to Dunkin' Donuts? Would you get a McDonald's donut? Where would you get your donuts? Or would you make your own donut? But that actually might, that might be quite difficult to do. Now we're moving on to the double quarter pounder with cheese. I don't think I've ever had a double quarter pounder. Oh my words. It looks amazing. Why have I never gone for this before? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The thing I love about it is that there's no like mass amounts of lettuce. Look at that. That's a monster. The monster burger is here. Okay, right. This is the Christmas edition, double quarter pounder with cheese. Let's see how it tastes. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Wow. That's a, I was gonna say that's a 10, but <laughs> that is so nice. I think that deserves a nine. That deserves a nine. The double quarter pounder with cheese because I always used to go for the cheeseburger, I didn't realize that the double quarter pounder with cheese is basically that, but just bigger. So that is now probably my new favorite burger that I'm gonna be getting from McDonald's. Moving back to the desserts, we have the Celebrations McFlurry. Now I'm a massive fan of McFlurries. Like whenever you get a McDonald's order, I always go for a little McFlurry as well. It's Evie's favorite. Normally I go for the Smarties one though. This is Celebrations. So what actually is it? Is it, it's not nuts, but 
If you can see inside, we've got some chocolate, we've got some like biscuit bits, but this looks tasty. Oh no, it's dribbling, dribbling, dribbling. No, 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 no. Yeah. Fun fact, did you know the top of this spoon is the actual thing they put on the machine and it mixes it? Yeah, I didn't know that until very recently actually, but look, that's the, that's the whole bit in the clip. That actually clips onto the machine. Okay, that's enough talking. Let's go for it. Let's let's go for a no, no, nice nice little taste. Ready? Mmm. Wow. I mean, the McFlurry ice cream is always great, but that's got biscuit bits. But I didn't get any of the I didn't get any of the chocolate. Hold on. Maybe that's just my excuse to just have another one. You know, it's coming up to Christmas. Why not? All right, ready? I'm gonna have to give that to Evie because she is gonna absolutely love that. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Right, so I wanna actually check because I feel like there's more Christmas stuff, right? Toffee latte, where's the toffee latte? Hot chocolate we don't have, caramel frappuccino we don't have, we do have the Celebrations McFlurry, we do have the jerk, jerk chicken sandwich, we do have the cheese melt dippers, we do have the double Big Mac, and we do have the reindeer snacks. So the only thing that we don't have is the coffee stuff, but you know, it's coffee and tea and stuff. That's pretty boring, isn't it? So to end things on a high, we have the double Big Mac Christmas edition. I've got a feeling this is just gonna be like lettuce, just lettuce everywhere. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Lettuce! <laughs> I was correct. No, no, it's not a problem. It's not a problem, the lettuce. You know, but the, oh my, look, it's like dripping, dripping, dripping. It's dripping everywhere. Just lettuce for days. Oh my word, are we ready for this? Three, two, one. Literally, it's been like a second and it's already got, it's already getting dark. So I was just finishing off the Big Mac and then the camera ran out of battery, but the Big Mac's good. I love the Big Mac sauce. The only thing I'll say, is I'm not sure whether I like that mid layer of bread. I, I mean, it's tasty, like, it's really good. But after trying that double quarter pound with cheese, oh, that, that hit the spot. So for the Big Mac, I think I'm gonna give it a seven and a half. And the deduction points are because there's, I'd say a little bit too much lettuce. And personally, I would just prefer sort of two patties rather than then like a separation of bread. So there we are. That is the McDonald's Christmas menu. Tried, tasted, enjoyed. It was actually really lovely. Um, so if you haven't gone to get yourself some McDonald's Christmas food, go and get it on my review right now. See what you like. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, then give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on another video. And let me know in the comment section below, what other Christmas fast food places should I try and review? And I'll see you guys next time with another video. Bye! Woo! Ollie, 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 Ollie,